Yesterday was awesome. I was very, very lucky. Um, I went further than I actually planned to go. Uh, I felt good and it was through a forest. Um, it was pretty easy walking. Well, it was really steep sometimes, but it was alright. Um, I came into a little village. I don't remember the name. It was something ending on uh, Obwa. Um, and I walked into a street that I actually had to go to to come to go to my uh, next stop the next day. Uh, a guy was standing outside. I asked him if he knew something to sleep for the night. And he said, yeah, there's a football field behind the corner. That was true. It's in the middle of the city, village, town. Uh, there's nothing. Everybody sees you. It's a bit weird. I couldn't really do that. So I asked him um, where the town hall was. On 400 meters on the left, he said. So I walked over there. Couldn't find it after 400 meters. A guy on a bike passed me by, said hi, and I asked him where the town hall was. Um, he immediately recognized that I was from Belgium. <laughs> My accent. Nice. Um, I explained what I was doing, and he offered me his backyard. So I went with him, and I ended up sleeping in his garage. Well, it was nice and not wet. <laughs> um, his wife prepared soup for me. I got breakfast in the morning. So, lucky me, again. <laughs> I'm uh, in my tent right now, it's raining, I'm actually camping illegally somewhere in the middle of a little village between some trees, it's like there's like a lot of garbage around here, it's like a bit of a dumping spot I guess, it's next to the train, um, the, the railroad, it's not the best place ever. I hope nobody comes here tonight, some chunkies or something, I hope not. It's raining, so, uh, yeah, tomorrow, um, another 28 kilometers to Saint-Quentin, that's gonna be my, uh, my day off, I guess, because my ankle my right foot actually doesn't look that good. I hope I can walk 30 k's tomorrow. I'm actually surprised that I walked 25 today. Um, thanks to what I walked more yesterday. So yeah. <laughs>